Praise be to the Lord. Today I will be speaking about Saints Anne and Joachim. Saints Anne and Joachim are the parents of the Blessed Virgin Mary. As the grandparents of our Lord Jesus, they are considered to be the patron saints of grandparents. Anne was born in Bethlehem in 50 BC, while Joachim was born in Nazareth in 50 BC. Anne married Joachim and although they lived a wealthy and devout life, they began to lament being childless. At the temple of Jerusalem, Joachim's sacrifice was rejected as the couple was childless. As a consequence of this, Joachim withdrew into the desert where he fasted and did penance for a period of 40 days. Anne promised God that if she were to conceive a child by God's grace, the child would solely be dedicated to God's service. Both Anne and Joachim received a vision of an angel, an angel that proclaimed that Anne was to conceive and bear a most wondrous child. The couple rejoiced at the birth of their daughter, whom Anne named Mary. When Mary was of three years of age, she was sent to the temple of Jerusalem to be brought up in the Lord's presence as a fulfillment of her mother's divine promise. In the early 8th century, Pope Constantine introduced Anne's devotion to the Roman Empire, while Joachim's cult was introduced in the western regions in the 15th century. Saint Anne became extremely popular in the Middle Ages and influenced theologians such as Johann Eck and John de Gerson. The Protevangelium became the foundation of the liturgical feast of, of the Nativity of the Virgin Mary on September 8 and the Immaculate Conception of the Blessed Virgin Mary on December 8. We celebrate their joint feast day on the 26th of July. Their love for one another and for their daughter Mary is an example from God on us on how to live. There is a church built in the name of St. Anne in Jerusalem which is be believed to be built at the site of the home where Saints Anne and Joachim lived in Jerusalem at the time of Mary's birth. I thank you for your time.